The fourth movement is the dry blade adductor slide. This is my favorite movement. It's simply the ability in four different steps to have the player return his stride and see if he can be accountable at the depth and the posture that they want to skate at. Come all the way down to the floor, find your fingertips, shoulder width position. Number one is striding out with that toe in. Number two is shifting your body weight. Number three is sliding your fingers. And number four is returning your stride without losing any skating height. So this is very important maneuver to stay low and fast. As we get better at this exercise, the, the athlete can feel the accountability that it takes to return your stride to a proper angle, but also keep your depth. So when athletes or when hockey players come up, that's where they lose their stride. So this, this movement specifically alone is for them to figure out where orientation of their blade and their skating height. Very important to shift your weight over, bring your fingers over, bring your body weight, but don't take too far of a step that, you can, that you're not accountable for. Over, slide the blade, shift your body weight, bring your fingers over, return your skating stride. 